Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy Manok once again, and this is Manok Presents Sailor Stories, Episode 6. Party! And party, and party, and party. When I was in Japan, the Kanagawa precinct were um, Tokyo, Jakuska, Yokohama, and all those places are, we went partying. But when I talk about partying, Sometimes we used to go out Friday, we'd get a hotel or stay in someone's house that we knew up there and we would go party from Friday to Sunday night or sometimes stay up there till Monday morning and make it down in the first train back to work. And those parties were crazy. Parties over there in Tokyo, they would not stop. I'm talking about Shibuya district. Oh my God. You'd be there all night, all night. Sometimes you come out of the club and you're like, oh, the sunlight's out, what the hell? When you go into the club, they have these little lockers and you put your cell phone there, you put your keys and all that stuff in there. You put a couple of hundred yen and they will close the locker in there. So that way, if you got too wasted or they spilled the drink on you, you would not lose your stuff because you would have the key to go back to the locker and get it. And... They would not take it out. They keep your stuff there. And if you don't get it back, they'll take it to the police or something like that. So your stuff was safe there. Unlike other places I know. So I'm going to tell you guys a little bit of the stories that happened when we was partying. I'm not going to name any names, but there was this dude that we always hang out with him all the time. And uh, one time he got a little bit too tipsy, if you know what I'm saying. He got so tipsy that he took what we call a shot to the face. It's hard to explain, but I'm going to show you guys exactly how it is. Let's say, for example, this is the shot. You're over here, you're like, Hey, what's up, man? How you been? Oh, I'm doing great, bro. Oh, I just took a shot to the face, didn't I? So, yeah, he took a shot to the face like that, and we was, like, laughing. I'm talking about dead ass laughing. He was gone. He could barely remember what was going on. And another time that we went partying, one of my best friends, he's like, oh, I'm hungry. And I'm like, okay, let's go. We go stop at this place, uh, TGI Fridays. You probably guys know what it is. Yes, there's some in Japan. We stopped there to get some food. And he's asking for tons of stuff from the menu. I'm talking about like, oh, let me have this. Let me have that. Let me have this. Let me have that. I'm like, Damn, how much stuff you gonna eat, bro? And he was like ordering a bunch of stuff and then he's like, oh yeah, order what you gonna order. So I order my food and then all the food comes and he falls asleep on the table. So I'm like, okay, maybe he's a little bit tired. So I eat my food, then I wake him up. I'm like, yo, get up. He's like, uh, what? I'm like, yo, you're gonna eat your food? He gets up, grabs the check. He goes and pays it and leaves all the food there. I'm talking about a hundred and something dollars worth of food and he just left it there. And I'm just thinking like, what the hell? So I go like walking after him. I'm like, are you okay? And he's like, yeah, I'm good. We gotta go. We're leaving. We keep walking. I'm like, are you gonna eat, bro? He's like, nah, I'm good. I'm good. So he keeps walking. We get on the train. We leave. And I'm thinking like, damn, that's a waste of money and food. We also had a friend that his name was... Cruz and he was what we call the forever wingman and he was a hell of a wingman and I'm talking about he will wing the shit out of any situation any situation if if you wanted a really good wingman he was the man to take anywhere we would go out so many places he would like he would have no trouble getting you the girl and winging it or taking one for the team. Well, when it came for us to be the wingman and him to get the girl, um, that's another story. <laughs> well, that's it for this episode of Manok Presents Sailor Stories. And uh, I know it was a little bit short, but there will be a part two of this coming soon or later on. Because there was way too many stories of parties to just end it right there. So, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys around.